hello guys hope you are doing good welcome back to the channel today's video i am going to show you three kinds of people who have moved to germany and are working in the data field in germany through different paths some of you who are in india who want to move abroad to germany these profiles can be your reference points or maybe inspirations first of all we have uh, manisha i'll put all the linkedin profile links in our description section so if you see manisha she has done a diploma in computer science and then also a bachelor of degree in computer engineering from Satyabama University in Chennai. Then right out of college, she has joined Amazon as a business analyst. Then she has done some freelance work, then moved to Rapido, which is one of the fast growing companies in India uh, in like the ride sharing space. And then after working there, recently she has moved to Babel in Germany as a revenue business analyst. right? And mostly, as you see, her skills lie in marketing analytics, SQL, Python, and so on. And Babel is a language-related app, right? So after working for four, five years in India in Amazon, Rapido kind of company, she has been able to make the move. This is option number one. Then we have Neha, Neha Singh. Uh, if you look at her profile, she has also done a bachelor's in uh, electronics communication engineering from LPU. Then after that, if we look at her jobs, she started in like services industry, like program analyst in uh, Cognizant, then moved on to another smaller company as a data analyst, and then also worked in Chandigarh for one, one and a half years as data analyst again. And then she moved to Affine Analytics. Uh, this is very fishy. She has transformed her skills. She has done a lot of stuff in data warehousing, SQL, Google Analytics, and so on. And after that, she has also worked in Ernst & Young, moving back to corporate again. She has fine-tuned her Tableau skills as well and some data modeling skills. And then in Jan 2022, she has moved to Germany as BA analyst in a company called Momox. They are usually in charge of like, like an e-commerce company with like uh, second-hand products. So if you see again, her skills mostly lie in like the data engineering angle, some SQL, some data warehousing, BigQuery, AWS, uh, Amazon Redshift and so on, right? So starting from services, working in startups, then working again in corporate in EY, affine analytics kind of, you know, uh, companies and then moving to uh, Germany as well. This is option number two with four or five years of experience. Another profile I found fascinating is uh, Sharvesh. Uh, so uh, done bachelor in mechanical engineering, then started out as a test engineer at Infosys. Then a couple of years, masters in Berlin and then started as a junior business intelligence analyst in a company and then transitioned into business analyst, business intelligence analyst at Movinga and then into the auto one group as BA manager. As you see, again, over here, he has used Python, Amazon S3, Redshift, Jenkins and, uh, you know, even MISQL and Tableau and currently working in HelloFresh, right? Again, moving more, let's say, to the data engineering slash data analyst angle. So, Worked in uh, services industry in India, done masters in Germany, then made two, three switches, currently working as PA analyst in HelloFresh, right? So this is another option. You can also come and do uh, masters in Germany. Some colleges are public schools, so fees is almost zero. So this is another option as well, right? So again, you can easily transition into Germany with like three years or more of experience in India itself if you make the right moves, right? So I'll hope that these profiles give you some inspiration uh, that will help you like consider moving to Germany. If you have any doubts, reach out to me on LinkedIn. I'll put my LinkedIn profile also. If you like the video, subscribe to the channel, share it with your friends. I will see you again in another video. Till then, take care.